Johnson, co-creator of the Quirkles, is with me today. Good to see you as always. Good morning, Tom. Now, of course, you know, the Quirkles, all the fun experiments that kids can do. And we're going to do another one right here. That's right. What do you got me into today? Well, this one is from the book, LE Electricity. So we're going to be doing some experiments with static electricity. Okay. So it's a good time this time of year because you put on that wool sweater and all of a sudden your hair standing straight up. Yeah, or you get out of a car and you kind of, you you almost blow yourself up is what it feels like. So the first activity, just take your wool sock. This is just a ski sock that I have. Yeah. Any piece of wool will work and just rub. Rub your balloon. Rub your balloon with your wool sock. Balloon, wool sock. And we're, what we're doing, Tom, is we're giving our balloon a negative charge. Oh, I thought we were shining the balloon. <laughs> or you could be shining the balloon, uh, Polish. Okay. You have to give it a giving good the neg- balloon. What kind of charge? A negative charge. All right, negative now, charge. Now we know that opposites attract, That's right? That's what they say. And you know. So, and that is a scientific principle. So now take your balloon and just put it over your tissue paper. Our cookie sheet there has okay. tissue paper. And see, don't touch it, but see if you can get the tissue paper to actually lift off the sheet oh, yeah. without touching it. So you can actually make it, it dance because it is attracting each other. Oops. So that's kind of fun for the kids to do. And sometimes we have a contest to see how many pieces they can get in a minute. And so that, so that's an easy one. And then let's Very just good. put that, and you, can act, and you can hear, you can hear it when you're taking it off. Yeah. It kind of making the crackling sound. Mm-hmm. So let's just put that aside. Okay. Put that down here. What, just the pan and, or the yeah, whole just thing? just the pan. Just put the well, now i got to take this yeah. off of there. Uh, now see and I now, my I want, now my tray has salt and pepper. And I want you to put, and it doesn't matter how much, just right. mix some salt and pepper in your pan and just kind of shake it up. Okay. And this is called the pepper, pepper dance. Oh. Okay, so okay. charge your balloon again. Oh, I've got to charge your balloon with again. With your... Whoops, I still have tissue paper on mine. These are MasterCard. Yeah. So we're going to charge it up. So I can hear yours. You should have washed this sock before you brought it in. (laughs) I washed mine, but yours. I think I've worn that a couple of times, Tom. I had my last ski trip. Yeah, right. Okay. So we're going to make the pepper dance here. Now let's see. Put it, see how far away you can lift the balloon and the pepper come up off the... Oh yeah! Can look hear at that. There it goes. You can hear it coming yeah, up, and I, you can hear I, I mean, it. It's. Can you hear it now? You have salt in there too, Tom. But do you have more salt on your balloon or pepper? More pepper. Right, and Why? that's be, that's because the salt is heavier than the pepper. Oh, it okay. still has a positive charge. Yeah. But it's heavier, so it doesn't come up off the tray as. Quickly. Oh, I have to remember it to will, keep a balloon in get, case I dump too much pepper on my right, french fries or something. And you want to separate the two. So that's, so that's fun and it's fun yeah. for kids to do and an yeah. easy way for them to see how static electricity works. Okay. Okay, so let's put that aside. Now, Tom, this is my cool new toy. Cool new toy, okay. Cool new toy. This is called the Fun Fly Stick. Well, and my, my family is really getting tired of seeing fun me. Fl- oh, okay. The fun fly stick. And I don't let just anyone use my fun fly right, stick. Okay. So this is really cool. Now, we saw how opposites attract. Right. But we also know that like objects repel. Yes. So what we're doing is I'd like for you to just turn that on. And what you're doing is giving that <laughs> stick ah, a negative charge. So charge up your stick. Okay, with the negative charge. And I'm going to drop. Now, I want you to put your hand to clear out. I'm going to put this on. Mm-hmm. I'm going to give it now. Oh, now. Look at that. Yeah. Now, wait a minute, though. Wait. We want it to, well, here we go. Sometimes it's a little. Now, we, I want you to get rid of it. All right. Okay, let me try it. Yeah, here you do. It. You show me because I'm just standing there like an idiot. Well, no. <laughs> no, it, it takes practice and it is kind of difficult. There's a surprise, and right, Sonia? sometimes it doesn't always work. So, here, <laughs> we're going to... And then I'm going to get it off, and now look, you can get it. Well, I didn't get it charged up. Okay. It, it, it does work. I believe me. you because you're driving work. your family crazy with yeah, it. Yeah, I'm driving my family crazy. Okay. Now, it, there you go. And see how oh, you yeah. can get it to lift up with the... Well, that's pretty neat. It is, and it will fly. Of course, this is just and one of the many the, experiments right. that the Quirkles do. How Absolutely. do they find the Quirkles? They can find them on our website, Quirkles.com, mm-hmm. or at IPA, Gold Mines, Anna Sophia's, yeah. and Fiction Facts and Fun. And you can go to OzarksFirst.com for more information. Right. you probably see this all over again. Terry, That's thanks a lot. Right. Always it's good always to see fun, you. Tom. I always have fun a good time. with the Quirkles. That's right.